What is a hidden bar behind the bookshelf? Wow! Hello friends! In today's video, I'm gonna show you a speakeasy bar which is hidden above a restaurant called Li Ho Ma. Here, you can immerse yourself in Hong Kong style with unique food and drinks. In this venue, you can use WisePass, a lifestyle app letting you access drinks such as wine or whiskey. To access these drinks, you need to download the app, sign up with an email, and subscribe to the plan you want. You can visit the link below to sign up and it's super easy to use. Oh my gosh, guys, I can't believe that in a noisy and crowded place like Saigon, I can find this calming bar so I can ease my mind and just hang out with my friends here. Lee's Lounge brings the concept of speakeasy bars to the next level by hiding it away from all the city's hustle and bustle. The term speakeasy bar became widespread in the United States during the Prohibition era from 1920 to 1933 when selling alcohol was illegal so the patrons needed to speak easy. Now this concept is here in Vietnam and people don't have to speak quietly anymore because now they can listen to live music and have a good time with their friends. I like the interior because it's equipped with elegant modern furniture, dim light and with chill music. Lee's Lounge reminds you of Hong Kong through the bar's signature drinks. In fact, the bartenders here come up with the new drinks inspired by classic Hong Kong movies from the 20th century, especially in the 90s, the golden age of Hong Kong cinema. You let me do that, there's no cocktail for you. It's a Mesola uh, cocktail, I believe. Uh... Ooh. Yeah, much chai cocktail. Much chai cocktail. What's in it? Yes, much chai is mean much rice in endless. Yeah, we make from Scotland whiskey and filled with cinnamon and cloves. We use handmade syrup with a herbal, Chinese herbal. Yeah, can you try it? Yeah, of course. Tastes like just like chai tea, like in India, is sweet. Yes. And I can smell like a hint of cinnamon in there. Yeah. Yeah. It's really good. Wow. It smells so good, right? Yes. Yeah, it smells it's really uh, good. from uh, Chinese herb herbal. Oh, okay. Yeah. Chinese herbal. Okay. Is there any condensed milk in here? Yeah. Uh, condensed milk, uh, uh, signature, please. Oh. We uh, remake. We are very strong, but when you uh, bring it, Mm -hmm. uh, you feel uh, very smooth, right? Yeah, I think this is a very comforting cocktail that I can just drink every day, you know? Yeah. Huh? yeah. I just really love the combination between the Chinese herbal, yes. uh, mixed very well with the Indian chai tea, mm -hmm. and then like your rolling technique. Yes. I think it's really cool. I've learned that rolling is a gentle way of mixing and chilling a cocktail. It's a good way to keep the drink cold. And now let's move on to the second drink. Ooh, this one looks really beautiful. What is it called? Yeah, this is Lang Kwai Fong cocktail signature. Oh, is that like a square of small streets in Hong Kong? Yeah, that has like right. a lot of bars and yeah. restaurants. This uh, is a uh, in, in inspired of Ramos in Fist. Ramos in Fist is a classic cocktail. So we uh, make it with the uh, butter life cheese, yeah, and a cream maize, a little bit cream maize. Yeah. And then it was like sprinkling with a uh, cinnamon powder as well, yeah. right? Okay, I think like this cocktail is gonna be sweet yes. and it's very suitable for ladies like uh -huh. me when they come to um, Lee's. So do you have like happy hours or like lady nights? Yes, it, uh, in a uh, happy hour menu. Happy hour in Lee Bar from uh, 5.30 to 8 p.m. every day. Okay, so how do I drink this? Like just drink it like that? Yeah. Oh my god, this is so fragile. I don't want you to like drop it. I think I'm gonna drink it like this. It's very yummy. It's like I can smell the little floral scent in it and it's sweet. It's a little bit sour. Yeah. So like where the sourness come from? Sour we make from uh, lemon juice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then like how can you make it uh, so cloudy like this? Yeah. Uh, it's uh, made from uh, add wine, uh, creamy. Yes, we shake. Oh, 
Shake it, shake it. Okay, he's a very skillful guy. I love the color too. It's purple and it's very delightful. And I love how you guys decorate it. I feel like every bar I go to, I can eat uh, the flower, which is like very cool. Um, color. This color is very trendy yeah. of the year, right? Yeah. Color same uh, iPhone 14 Pro Max, right? <laughs> this lounge bar is hidden above Li Ho Ma, which is a restaurant, so you can find delicious dishes to eat while drinking. Oh my gosh, guys, so much food right now. I don't think that I can finish everything, but then my teammates, my cameraman, can finish it with me. So the first one is called Kui Tung Bang. So this one is all fish alley yummy. And let's try to see what's inside. Mm. Yeah, I can taste the fish in there. I love the crispy outer part of the snack. What a great combination. And I love the sauce as well. So this snack was inspired from Hong Kong street food, but come with a modern twist from the high-end Western ingredients. And a fun fact that I just learned that the sauce was imported from Hong Kong. How cool is that? Moving on to the next one is lo mein platter. This contains simmered pork, beef shank, cuttlefish, mustard, and sweet sauce. Mm. Yummy. It's very good. This dish reminds me of phalo in Vietnam, and I'm gonna leave phalo right here so you can look it up, or you can subscribe to my social media and my channel to find out what it is, because I'm gonna post it on my story. The next one is lotus leaf steamed brown rice and it contains lotus leaf, lotus seed and vegetable stew. Super delicious and it's super healthy too. It's a little bit spicy. When you eat this steamed brown rice, you eat it with the stew mushroom. A little bit spicy, it's totally suitable for a vegetarian. Highly recommend. All right, last but not least, this is heart on string. This one contains the Sichuan noodles, beef, chili oil, sesame oil, and homemade sauce. Mm. The noodles are so thick. It's so good. I love when I have like mouthful food. And with the vegetable and the beef, super delicious. Oh my gosh, I'm so full right now, but you know what? My stomach always has a space for dessert. And this one is called Ginger Bomb. And let's see how it tastes. Um, actually, the waiter tell me to just wait a little bit so it can cool down. So just be careful, okay? Don't burn yourself. Wait for about like one or two minutes. Mmm, it's just like popping in your mouth. I can definitely taste the ginger in here and then I can also taste the chewy texture from the glutinous rice dumpling. And in Vietnamese, it's called bánh choi nước. I'm gonna leave it right here so you can check it out. All right guys, so thank you so much for watching this episode today. If you are looking for a hidden bar to have good food and chill atmosphere and good drink, I highly recommend you to go to Lee's. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, subscribe to Wise Pass, and come to Lee's to just have a fun and good time with your friends. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! cho nó vào video nhá. Cái gì vậy? Em ăn gì hai giờ gì đó. Cái gì vậy? Ngon quá. Tôi sẽ làm.